This 3 News Now update sponsored by Godfather's Pizza. Order today. I'm Courtney Johns with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. We have an update on the Costco plant incident. We now know the names of the victims. The Fremont Police Department has identified 56-year-old Melvin Balaban of Crete and 26-year-old Caleb Sabatka. Balaban died after falling 40 feet off a scissor lift and Sabatka also suffered injuries in the fall. Crews were called to the plant around 9.30 a.m. yesterday and Balaban was pronounced dead at the scene. And the Mueller report has some interesting information about an Omaha case. According to the report, recently apprehended WikiLeaks author Julian Assange may have capitalized on the murder of Omaha native and DNC staffer Seth Rich to hide how he received sensitive information. Rich was shot and killed back in July of 2016 in what was deemed an attempted robbery. We have more on Mueller's report on our website at 3newsnow.com. And on 3 News Now, meet Rubble just marks today as the sunshine continues through the rest of the afternoon. At 4 o'clock this afternoon, we're sitting in the mid-60s, and we stay in the mid-60s by 6 o'clock, eventually dropping down to the low 60s by 8 o'clock. But either way, a nice night in store and plenty of sunshine before it does, does come to an end. Saturday then, we're a little bit breezy, but those winds are out of the south, pushing in even warmer air. We'll top out in the upper 70s on Saturday. Sunday, the cold front now coming through later in the day, and that gives us enough time to again push into the upper 70s for your east. Easter. Lots of sunshine to start the day for those Easter egg hunts and the sunrise services, but in the afternoon, just a few more clouds out and about across the area. Thankfully, though, with that cold front coming through later, the spotty rain showers have also pushed back in time, probably not arriving until at least Sunday night. Some of that spotty rain continues then into early Monday, a little bit breezy as the cooler air pushes in behind the cold front. That drops us down into the mid 60s. That's where we'll stay for Tuesday and then a little bit warmer by the middle part of our next work week. That's right, gang. The Godfather's going for three. The three-piece big cookie combo, that is. Get a medium specialty pie, a medium one-topping pie, and the MVP, a frosted basketball cookie. Godfather's Pizza. Do it.